Okay, well, first of all, I can't figure out um, where to look at this. So I, I feel like I'm looking like uh, Ray Charles or Stevie Wonder, you know, like I'm blind as a bat. But I really, I, I look, if I look down there, I don't know if I'm looking at the camera or not. If I look at the screen, then I'm not looking at the camera, so um, I'm on my iPad. I'm going to tilt this just a bit. I am just, I just passed through security at uh, Houston Intercontinental Airport. I will not call it what they call it now, uh, but it's uh, Houston Intercontinental. And uh, I got the pat down again, uh, did the opt-out. Uh, the young man was trying to tell me how much radiation those machines don't put off, and I told him what the research I've done. He said, well, everybody's entitled to their opinion, sir. But uh, as I pass through uh, security, right, okay, there's security right over there. And then I go, how do I stop into Chili's? And I get a salad and a drink. And I am served with my salad plastic silverware. Now, the music of my generation set us up for this generation. They set us up for looking at what is coming. Um, and all I could think is, Paranoia strikes deep. That's really bad. I'm off to and everything. Into your heart it will creep, creep. There's a man with a gun over there. I mean, these songs that they sung to us years ago, and I know I, I have not figured the lighting out on this one, but, um, well, I can turn the cam around, I guess. And, uh, no, I can't in the middle of it. But uh, at any rate, the young man who was serving me got laughing. He said, yeah, they have to serve you plastic silverware because you've already passed through security. <laughs> and I was like, oh, come on. This is, you know what I mean? I don't think any person who has taken over an airplane has taken the fast food silverware and done it. But, I mean, my, the music of my generation uh, has uh, set us up for so many things. This morning I was exercising in my brother's house uh, in Texas, and I can hear the national anthem being kind of screamed. Someone was uh, doing it a cappella, and it really was not that uh, entertaining. But I thought, wait a minute, what are they pushing down people so now? But the neat thing was, a few minutes later, I heard all swimmers, all swimmers to the starting line. And I thought, oh my God, my brother lives in a neighborhood in Texas, and I am hearing the start of uh, swim meet. And I can't tell you how many hours we, uh, me, some, my wife, a whole bunch, spent uh, at swim meets in Texas, and they started them all with the national anthem, and uh, so I realized back where I was, and I called my wife, and I said, you know, I listened to it, and it seemed like indoctrination, but uh, then I realized it was uh, the indoctrination at a swim meet. <laughs> but paranoia, again, I was patted down, uh, because I looked so dangerous, and I was served silver uh, plastic um, cutlery at the Chili's because that's the only thing they can trust us with anymore. Have fun. Love you. www.micpeakperformance.com